Hey everyone, welcome to 456 to the Ultimates, and welcome to episode 69, Giggity, of Let's Platinum, Rising Zero Dawn. <laughs> um, Alright, what I'm going to do is, there's a metal flower over here. Uh, I'm going to get this campfire, and then I'm going to fast travel to this um, campfire and get the... Oh, there's the broadhead. There. And get the metal flower, and then come back. Just because I want to try and get most of that stuff out of the way. Alright, so where is it? Let me just... There we go. Very close. Okay, and we're there. Alright, so now, I don't think I can take my mount with me, which sucks. I don't know how I missed this metal flower, but... Let's just go back. Uh, I think the trophies in this game... They made it, like... So you don't have to do everything. Oh, I do can keep my mount. That's interesting. Um, hang on. Turn around. There we go. Oh, let me climb up. Yeah, you go, Broadhead. Hello. Goodbye. Alright, so where is it? Over here to the right? Yeah. Oh, oh come on. What? No, I didn't. No. Go for it, go. Uh, I don't know. This one? Getting destroyed. Wow, the board head, like, obliterated him. <laughs> Good job, buddy. Oh gosh, he's gone. He's actually quite damaged. <laughs> Alright, stop, stop, stop. Wait, how do I stop? Circle, right? Oh god. Not good, not good. Where the hell is this metal flower? Is that it there? That's it there. Right in front of me. Uh, okay. Hop off. Did I just hit it? I think I hit its corner. off. First let me grab it so that way I don't miss it. Yeah. This is crazy. What on earth? I wonder if I attempted this before and I died. Because it is insane how many enemies there are here. Finish him. I'm able to hit them so effectively now. Okay, I really need a potion. And another one. Why are there so many of you? Can I please thank you? Come on. Alright, cool. Wait, wait. Damn it. <laughs> Did anyone drop anything good? Probably not. Nope. <laughs> I wonder if these like smaller machines have a, an actual chance to drop something good. Because I'm pretty sure it's sort of only the big ones. Poor Broadhead. Alright, cool. So I got everything here. I still haven't sold all those coils. I should probably do that soon. Um, Alright. Let's have a look. So we need to go back up there. There's also this metal flower I wanted to get because it's right next to this corrupted zone. Um, hmm. And then it leads to that. So if I wanted to do that, I'm actually going to go... Oh, I can fast travel here. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Let me just look at my notebook real quick. Ah, okay. It's the metal flower. Um, okay. So, let's fast travel over here. I'm surprised I didn't get that little... 
campfire that's just slightly northeast of um, the hunting grounds. Oh, maybe because I couldn't see? Like, maybe because I didn't have the long legs um, sort of, like, map uncovered? That could be it. Yeah. Hopefully I find those two power cells that I need for that other quest, because I think you need that for a trophy. I think you need to, like, get that um, chest piece or whatever it is. Outfit? Outfit. Um, for, for a trophy. So I have no idea where that power cell is, but hopefully it comes up soon. Okay, come on. There we go. Alright, so let's target this. And now I just need to see... Yep, okay, in the right direction. Ah, oh, yeah, I know. So I want to get out of here as soon as possible, once I defeated everything. Okay, go, 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 go. Up. Are there fish in here? Not in that one. Saving these for the trail. All right, where are we going? Here to the right. How did I wait? How did I get so much experience? Uh, probably from fighting all those enemies. <laughs> oh yeah, because like each machine gives you a thousand. Alright, uh, Corrupted Zone's a little bit further ahead. Now, it's level 32, so I'm going to have kind of a hard time, maybe. Um, but, I'll see which machines we got, and then I'll make a plan, I guess, when I get there. How am I going to... Yeah, let's just keep running over here. I wonder if there'll be a Corrupted there. I kind of want to kill that thing. Where's the... That's weird. Is it this? It is this, okay. It's not even a path, it's just like, it's underwater. <laughs> That's strange. It like a spider. It carries a container on its back. I wonder what's inside. Why you've repeat, you've said that before. <laughs> Oh, what is that? Are they snap wars? Oh, but they're not corrupted. Where the hell's the... Must be up there. Look at this night time, look at that moon. <laughs> Alright, um, here we go. New infected zone, corrupted zone. <laughs> Alright, what do we got? Rock breaker. Okay, we haven't done... Oh god. More than one rock breaker. Hmm. Okay, let's tag him. Alright, so how should we take this, these guys on? There's a lot of foxes here. Oh, no, sorry. Second one was a turkey. Alright, so its body is weak to ice and fire. The exhaust port is weak to pierce. So, the fuel sack. Um, but the digging arm is weak to tear. Alright, let's try this. First, I'm gonna put down fire or blast traps or whatever they're called. Just a matter of time. Let's see if this works. I think I'll grab the extra health thing. And now let's try. Come and get me. Okay, that worked out not as good as I hoped, but okay. Where's that fuel sack? What? What? <laughs> Is that the other one? <laughs> I have no idea what happened. Wait. Man, they must do a crap ton of damage, because I had the increased health thing, didn't I? So I had like 
750 or 780, 770 health or something like that. So, yeah, maybe that's what it was. I, Damn, I was doing so well against that first one too. Let's have a look again. Oh, what? I'm all the way back here? Since when? Ah, oh, come on. Alright, well, I didn't know that, so I'm gonna... I guess I'll make it back to the corrupted zone and try again. I'll get this campfire on the way. Did I not get that one on the way? <laughs> the hell? Alright, I'll, um, I'll get the campfire on the way and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back again. Let's try. Um, alright, so... I still honestly don't know what the hell happened. Um, so let's go one, two. I don't see it coming. I'll just put like all three, in fact, near each other. What the hell? Did you notice me? Uh oh. Did you notice me? One, two, three. Nice. But it didn't do anything. Where is he? Um, hang on. Damn it, man. Yeah, this is ridiculous. They do so much damage to me. I'm gonna try and run away. What the hell? These guys do an insane amount of damage. Alright, I think I need something different. Well, actually, one thing is that I don't have uh, an outfit. I don't think I've purchased an outfit that has, like, good defense or whatever. Um, so I'm going to try and do that, I guess. Alright, this presents a little bit of a challenge. Let's try and work it out. Alright, so let's look at my... Outfits, what have I got? No protection, cannot be sold. This is stealth based, isn't it? Yep, and I put something random in there for some reason. Oh, no, I didn't want to equip it. This is fire, and this is also stealth. Alright. Um, so, I need, I need to... Jeez, I have a lot of stuff here. <laughs> oh, look, I get to keep those keys for some reason. Um, alright, so, yeah, we need to, alright, so I'm not going to do that. Um, I'll focus on that when we get to a new village or whatever. Um, we can get there pretty quick from this campfire, so maybe the smartest thing to do right now is to go back to here, Meridian, um, go to a merchant and try and purchase the, uh, like, whatever the one that gives me defense is and see if I have any uh, coils that uh, are conducive to that because that is those things hurt like hell like I had like I said I think I had like 750 health or whatever it was and he hit me and did like half my health in one hit And then the rest after that, pretty much. So, yeah. And those blast traps didn't really seem to do anything. I should probably look at that again, actually. I thought I was being clever with those blast traps, but no. Oh, I should have tried to tie them down. That's what I should have tried to do. Ugh, oh, silly me. <laughs> I should have at least tried that once, but I think it's still going to be worthwhile to purchase an outfit with, um, with, like, protection. More heavy protection. Alright, come on. We're almost there. Alright, so let's figure this out. Where's the nearest normal merchant? There you are. Okay, and we'll, we may as well do the uh, Hunter's Lodge thing while we're here. Uh, gosh, I hate trying to find these guys. <laughs> Alright, outfits. So we've got... Here we go. 
Studded leather hammer still protects the wearer from projectile attacks. No true Osram pulls out the arrowheads. Melee attacks. Alright, so we need melee attacks. This is pretty much what we want. So let's go ahead and purchase that. Um, we don't need to wear it just yet. This is a bit of everything. Freeze damage, stealth. Interesting. Corruption also might be decent. Okay. Um, no, we don't need any of that. Oh, yes, I wanted to see what this was. So, Blast Trap. Why do... Wait, the Blast Trap doesn't do fire damage? That's weird. None of these do fire damage. I've got a Shock one. There's no Freeze one either. Let's purchase this. Since I have an exorbitant amount of metal shards. Um... I would like to buy a modification box. I'm gonna buy the Shard Gambler's box because I have plenty of, uh... Why can't I purchase it by holding X? Because now I, I'm gonna try and, like, get as many Shard Gambler's boxes as I possibly can from now on since I have so much... so many shards. Alright, let's figure this out. Oh, actually, before we do, um... Sell. <laughs> so, pretty much anything that's below 10%. Uh, below, well, we'll start with below 10%. All the greens, easily below that. Okay, now 15%. Okay. There's one, don't need that, don't need that. Resist ranged attacks, okay, so yeah, there we go, resist melee attacks. I was like wondering, I don't think I've ever seen like a coil that says resist melee attacks, but no, nope, there's one. Get rid of that, get rid of that. Okay, now, uh, let's have a look, outfits. So, what do we have? Resist ranged, fire, shock, ranged, freeze, shock, melee. So the only one I have that resists melee attacks, okay, I have some of this. Alright, maybe the best choice is then to use this. So we'll go with resist corruption and resist corruption and melee attacks. Because that's something at least. Um, I just don't have anything better at the moment. Um, what I can do though is open all this stuff. Nice. Raise a heart. Oops. Jeez, so many things. Alright, here we go. 9, 3, 15, 2, 1, a rock. 9, 2, 1, 2. Okay, it wasn't worth it. <laughs> um, Alright, so we need to sell some more stuff. Oops. Alright, resources. Uh, let's get rid of you. Uh, freeze, shock, let's get rid of that. Corruption. I'll get rid of all this bony meat. Uh, actually, I'll get rid of like 10, because that way I can get the rest. Don't need to watch a heart, don't need to watch a lenses. Scrap a lens. Metal vessel. Actually. Yeah, I'll give her some chill water. After all that spending of shards, now I'm gonna get everything back. <laughs> 5,000. Nice. Actually, I might purchase a modify a modification box just to see what it comes with, because if it's... Like, it's purple, or very rare, so it should come with, um... You know that level of quality and if it comes with more than one that'll be even more useful all right got plenty of wire the wire is like hard to wait let's just get rid of like 20. lemon spraying you can go Flint hawk lens trampler 
tiny meat. I don't think I need that anymore. Raccoon. Uh, apparently I can trade with merchants, but screw it. Nice machine core large. Don't need those. Don't need those. Don't need those. Alright, cool. So, let's see if I can purchase... Well, first of all... Uh, bony meat. Bony meat. Wire. Rock. Uh, where are the rocks? These two... Hang on. I got an idea. <laughs> and throw. And that way I can grab that. And we're good. Alright, let's try purchasing a modification box. Random, very rare weapon or outfit modification. So only one. That's really stupid. And you can purchase more than one. Okay, come on. That is interesting. That might actually be alright. <laughs> oh, it's the wrong one, isn't it? Yeah, it's the... That's why it's green. Uh, let me have a look here. But it might be, it's better than this one. 39% corruption. Well, at least my corruption bow can do a crap ton of corruption. <laughs> look at that, it's almost full. <laughs> it's insane. Um, okay. Where's the uh, rope caster that I'm using? Here. 30% handling, 18% handling. Oh, I can swap it with this. 25% tear. Can be swapped with 37% tear. Wait, does it need tear? Yeah, it's got it there. Alright, cool. So, wait, what's going on there? Okay, nothing. Um, one, two. Do I want to purchase another modification box? Just on the off chance. How many shards have I got? Uh, uh, let's go one more just in case I'm... I mean, I'm sure I'm going to get more shards soon and I'm not really using them for much else at the moment, so I think it's fine. Ooh, it's a good one. 48% freeze. So is that... That's probably this, isn't it? No, it's not. It's the other one, isn't it? It's the damage one, which means... I might even be able to get more freeze going. Even though I don't really use freeze that much. Oh my god, it came with... Jesus! 48% freeze, 19% damage, and 11% corruption, which I don't need. But that is... That's one of the best I've seen. <laughs> Look how good that is. That's... What is that? Uh, 50, 60, 90, 60, 90, 90. 78. 78%, I think. Yeah, 78%. Um, things on that. Um, alright. So, that's all that. Let's, um... I don't think using the other outfit slows me down, so I'm just gonna put it on. How do I put it on? Oh, I'm crafting. Uh, where is it? Outfits. Equip. And now, the other thing I wanted to do was... Alright, let me sell one more time with the modifications. So we're going to get rid of this, of course. And then this one, and we don't need 16% stealth. And I think there was one more. Let's get rid of that. That. Just get. I think I moved it up to getting rid of uh, anything lower than 20%. There we go. Now we're a bit more clear. 20 out of 70, so we've got plenty of space for modifications. Um, alright. Oh, she looks different. Hooray! <laughs> um, do I have enough time to give it another shot? Not really, because I've got to go to Hunter's Blind. Alright, I'm going to hand in this quest real quick and then we'll call it... Oh, I was like, what is that? That's probably the rock. <laughs> uh, if it's over there... Wait, 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 wait. How do I select it? Where's the flag? Oh, God, I hate this thing. Wait. I think it's like this. I 
think I have to get close sometimes when I wanted to get that flag to appear. It's really silly though. And of course I'm going the wrong way. I think if I just make it my active quest it'll probably work, but no. How much time? Oh, I don't really got much time. Oh dear god, where the hell is this thing? <laughs> Uh, hang on. Oh, I am getting there now. But I don't know. Yeah, there we go. Have you always needed to have it as a main... As your, like, active quest or whatever? So that the flag appears? I'm not really sure. Alright, quickly, a cease. Uh, Talana, yeah. always a pleasure. I see you brought your pet. Greetings, Sunhawk. I hereby sponsor Aloy of Venora for membership in the Hunter's Lodge. No. Look at her. She's lowborn, a savage. This is beneath even you, Talana. She has fulfilled the requirements. And Sun King Avad decreed the Lodge should be open to all. Would you like to take it up with him? The word of the Sun King is indeed law. Even though it will bring ruin to the Lodge, so be it. Do you, Aloy of Venora, pledge to act rightly and nobly when in service to the Lodge all the days to follow? I do. Members of the Lodge, even though Tarkas is barely cold, I present to you Aloy of Venora. Member and Thrush, what say you all? To the hunt! Sponsoring <laughs> Outlander. <laughs> While you make meaningless gestures, I'll be finding Red Maw. Alright. Oh, a tear blaster weapon box. Yeah, this is. I was curious about what this is. What is that? That looks like it could be special. Tutorials. No open tutorials, and yet it said that I have something here. Wait. There we go. Remove 15 machine components with the Tear Blaster. You've acquired a powerful new weapon, the Tear Blaster, capable of firing new ammunition types. This combat challenge will help you learn its utility and own your skills. Alright, this is awesome. Why is that level 10 only? <laughs> uh, deals very high tear severity on impact. Releases a compressed air blast, tearing anything. Of anything that touches useful stripping armor and components off machines. What about if I compare that to... Which one is it? Or did they just replace the old one? Tear Blast Arrow. No, Tear Blast Arrow is there. Oh, hello. One. Ah, I need a fishbone. <laughs> That sucks. Oh, I should... Hang on. I should create jobs. And that way I can just... <gasps> I'm so silly. Why didn't I do that before? Maybe I, I feel like I might have done it... Like, I might have known about it before, but I was like, ah, I don't need to do that. Like an idiot. I'm just gonna quickly create jobs for all this. Oops. Oh. Uh, that one... Of course, I say just a quick thing, and now we're doing this for ages. Alright, cool. So we've got all the jobs in there, right? Beautiful. Now we know how much we need. I like it. Uh, Deadliest game. Talk to Talana. I'll do it later. Tomorrow. Next time. Whatever. And I wanted to look at the ammo. Ah, here we go. Deals no damage and very high tear. Deals very high tear, severe impact. Release compressed air blast. Tearing off anything. Alright, so basically it's just a very strong version of this. Alright, this tells me that we're going to have like a super... Like, if this is a super weapon of the normal tear blaster that I have, then this is telling me that we're going to have super weapons of the whole thing. Oh, but there's a problem. This doesn't come with, like, the other stuff. Like, uh... What is it? The harvest arrow and the piercing arrow. That's bad. Nor does it have, uh... 
spots, uh, like modification spots. Hmm, interesting. All right, we'll talk to Talana next time. Uh, all right, I want to thank you all for watching episode 69 of Let's Platinum Horizon Zero Dawn. My name is Ultima456 at The Ultimates, and I'll see you next time.